Hello everyone, and welcome back to another recording of Freight Train Live. And yeah, whew, guys, I went through some just unnecessary struggle trying to figure out how to record this with the the, the mic set up and the, the sound quality. I I'm I think I finally got it. I think this is I'm gonna be using this microphone here um, as as the as as the sound catcher because <laughs> like holy moly I was like I was trying to use my AirPods those weren't working I was uh, trying to just do it with the 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 regular iPhone mic and that was not working and oh my goodness the 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 wireless one I have. Um, the it, there's like a buzzing sound there's a whole whole slew of slew of mistakes slew of errors and it's just so it's like oh my goodness but uh yeah this this one sounds pretty good i did some testing before and it, it sounded sounded good so you know i think i think that's the lesson for the way for the day is uh sometimes you got to get out of your own way and uh just kind of realize what works and what doesn't work excuse me because like like a lot of times like I'll know what works and what doesn't work and I'll I'll still do it the way that doesn't work just because like I'm so stubborn that's the word I'm so stubborn and like set in my ways like a like a donkey or a mule I'm like just like nope um, doesn't matter w- what like what it is I will do it the 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 wrong way if it's just just because like I can you know. Um, but yeah, I'm, uh, you know, kind of learning ever so slowly and surely that, um, you know, find what works and, and, and roll with that instead of always just looking for, always kind of searching outside yourself for like, um, enjoyment or pleasure, you know, is it, sometimes it's about sitting back and, um, realizing, uh, that you're, you're part of the universe and you're, you are the universe, and um, it's kind of re- using that knowledge. Um, yeah, it's like using that knowledge to um, become your best self. Like we talked about, we talk a lot about um, self improvement on this channel. Um, and I was thinking, guys, um, since this is Freight Train Live, the, the YouTube channel, um, you guys could be called like the railroaders. Um, and so when you subscribe to uh, Freight Train Live, you get to become a railroader. Uh, and that's, that's uh, yeah, kind of my, my catchy nickname for you guys. You know, like a lot of times um, YouTubers will uh, use like adages uh, for their subscribe, uh, <coughs> excuse me, names for their subscribers. Like, you know, there's a couple like PewDiePie has a name for his subscribers, like um, let's say like H3H3 Productions has uh, a name for their subscribers. Like different different YouTubers have different names for their subscribers, right? So here on here on Freight Train Live, you cool cats get to be called the Railroaders. Uh, so when you subscribe, you get to be a railroader. There you go. Um, so yeah, uh, life has been going pretty well. Um, been sober now for um if it hasn't been 100 days it's getting pretty close to 100 days um so yeah that's that's going pretty good um i was thinking about it and i was like you guys are like totally uh a great motivation for me to stay sober because i'm like all right well now you guys know i've been sober this long so uh gotta gotta hold me accountable for that guys um in, in girls uh women thank you guys so much just for everything it's been really cool seeing like the the subscriber count go up and the the view count go up the likes the comments the comments are really great like i i love seeing you guys comment keep commenting on the videos i really appreciate it um i, re- I love reading the comments uh because a lot of like because they're all just so been so positive and, and nice so far I'm, I'm just so lucky and blessed because like that's you know as we all know that's not always the case on the internet like 
lot of times people can troll and, and be kind of mean or rude. So um, it's just really awesome to to see the nice comments. Like somebody was like, God bless you and uh, like keep moving forward and all that. Like it was just so, so great to, to see and to uh, read. I was just like, I replied to the comments because I, I just really appreciated that. And um, it just made me feel really good to know that um, my words, my just me, my silly little, you know, YouTube podcast um, is helping people with their lives. Because um, that's, I mean, that's that's the goal, um, right? Is is to feel good. Um, I if I can, if my, you know, my um, short little videos can help help you with your day, then. Um, that's awesome. That's, that's really special. Um, this is, this is me following my dream. This is, this is really what I want to do is kind of be a, um, motivational speaker. Um, if I can become a YouTube partner and, and get that off the ground, that would be, that'd be great. Um, working on it. We're getting there. Uh, you guys are making it happen. Thank you guys so much for uh, making it happen so far. It, it, it fills me with a warm, fuzzy feeling inside, knowing that um, um, you guys out there hear my voice and and see me and 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 like me and and think I'm a cool guy. It just is awesome. Uh, you guys are awesome. I I believe in you all 150 uh, percent. It just um, it just, it, this just kind of makes sense for me, you know, I, a lot of times, like, there's a lot of jobs out there that I think I could do, but I, I think I, I kind of struggle, admittedly, I struggle with, like, tasks sometimes, like, like, if somebody gives me a task, I'm like, I, I kind of have a hard time kind of complaining it sometimes, so if I can, like, set my own tasks and my own goals, then I kind of feel a little bit more comfortable with that, um, but, yeah uh anyway uh super happy that i get to inspire you guys um got a therapy appointment tomorrow uh gonna be working with my therapist to um kind of just keep getting better you know because we're we're finally getting better um for a while i was i was kind of in denial and i was uh not not feeling too good about myself and kind of just beating myself up and not giving myself the the time of day you know and uh now I, now I really am and it's starting to starting to show starting to starting to become apparent um the the progress um I, I think I said earlier I almost have probably like 100 days of sobriety now and um just as great like to know that I, I can do it I can get through life drug free um, because for a while I, I like if you told me a year ago I would get through life drug free I would have called you a liar like I, I was pretty pretty well well entranced in that in that world um, but I'm definitely broken out of it I'm definitely 100% clean sober and uh, it just feels good because I'm actually being honest and actually um, like being a good person, you know, and because I was like just not being a, I was like I was like telling myself like, oh yeah, I'm a good guy, I'm 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 awesome, I'm killing it, I'm doing really good, and I just wasn't, and now like I'm actually actually starting to kill it and actually starting to do good and be awesome and um, yeah, it's 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 taken a little bit to catch up to that those actions but uh starting to feel it um starting to feel a lot more like myself uh like i'm sure you can <laughs> watch back at the beginning of the videos i was probably a lot more flustered and a lot more like uh like freaking out but now uh, i feel like i'm getting a little more cool and calm and collected uh and that's that's what life is about being cool calm collected we here on freight train live us the railroaders uh we're cool calm collected young men and women we we focus on what matters we have our five five points um 
think maybe we can call them like our five our five tracks uh our five railroad tracks because we're you know the, the train theme <laughs> they got family family friends working out taking care of yourself taking care of others five tracks of life that we railroaders like to ride upon um yeah and it's it's up to us railroaders to um ride the tracks of life uh in a way that makes sense for you um because everybody's 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 railroad railroad track looks different you know we all don't have the same same materials that our railroad tracks are made of we all have different materials for our railroad tracks um it's just you know it's a beautiful thing uh that's that's a great part of great great part of god's vision for us is that he he's a different one for for everyone and he wants us all to um excuse me you know be be good people uh help each other be kind um don't don't be unkind uh don't be rude or mean like be considerate and and thoughtful in your actions and um look out for look out for everyone look watch each other's backs make sure make sure everyone's uh doing good make sure we're all on the same page um you know like if somebody seems like they're lost like say you're doing like a group reading and um it seems like one person is like confused that, that would be me <laughs> i'd be like that one person who's like what, what what are you guys talking about try and try and help that person um with their their you know their struggle um because we all definitely struggle um nobody's perfect right and uh i was i was saying in these last recordings that never were um that uh there there's a pretty good there's this there's this thing on instagram um this video short clip uh of brad pitt um the actor and he um was talking to this woman and was i think he plays like a god in that movie or something he's like the gods envy the mortals because uh we because we are mortal because we have finite lives um any moment could be our last moment um and that that idea is 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 pretty um important i would think to i think to consider because if you think like any moment could be your last it's like wow that's that's pretty mind-blowing um that like each moment is simultaneously becoming the moment and not becoming the moment becoming the moment, you know like that that valley peaks and valleys kind of thing it's 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 pretty pretty crazy you know it's, it's pretty mind-blowing stuff existence you know <laughs> um but yeah uh like i've said it's really cool um seeing the subscriber count go up the view count go up hope that keeps happening uh, i'll keep making videos for you guys for sure because it just is awesome uh i love doing it um hopefully hopefully it can get to partner sometime sometime in the near future um because that would be awesome to get paid to do it too not that i don't love doing it but like it'll just be like an added bonus um but yeah, so I'll, I'll share um, a history fact for you guys from weareteachers.com. Uh, it's that ketchup, the condiment that we all put on our uh, food to make it taste better, um, was once thought of as a medicine. And yeah, I know that's it's pretty mind blowing. Like, like you know, think, think like, oh, like Tylenol, Advil, that's a medicine, not not ketchup. But no, actually. Um, ketchup was once prescribed as a medicine like a doctor would be like you need to take more ketchup <laughs> like you like you go and take like take an advil if you're feeling pain it's like oh you got stomach issues you gotta you gotta take some ketchup <laughs> it even sounds funny like take ketchup like no you eat ketchup right um or you eat ketchup on food so it's it, you know it's pretty pretty wacky pretty pretty funny um nothing too nothing too serious but it, it, i just thought it was interesting um ketchup was once considered a, a medicine just like tylenol so there you go um yeah this has been uh freight train live i will 
I will see you railroaders. Uh, I will see the railroaders in the next episode. Bye.